Okay, this is going to be a super quick video um, showing the full Gmail website on the Microsoft Surface RT uh, just because I've been getting questions about this lately. So the full Gmail website actually works on the Surface RT. Uh, this is uh, just the built-in browser. Uh, there are parts of it that uh, are a little bit slow and other parts that are quick. So for example, scrolling is very smooth, uh, uh, very responsive, very fast. Uh, navigating into uh, an email, so if I were to click on an email, that one takes a little bit of time, but it pops up there. So here in this case, pictures are disabled, but I can enable images. Pops up right there. So that's that's not too bad, you know, for the Surface RT. I can imagine for the Surface 2, things will be a lot more quick. So let's look at what else works on here. So if I go click on this, I can look at my tasks. And sure enough, task pops up right down there. Very responsive. I can minimize tasks. Uh, I can, if I wanted to compose an email, click that. And sure enough, the compose pops up. Again, I can minimize compose, uh, maximize that. Uh, I can have tasks and compose side by side. So those work in the full version of Gmail. Pretty cool. Uh, what else works? Uh, let's see. Uh, looking at my Google Plus notifications, you can see that the scrolling isn't quite as smooth, but it still works. It still works. Um, let's see. Okay, that works. The only thing that I noticed that really uh, doesn't work is actually uh, using Google Hangouts. I think that I can't call uh, on my computer. I can actually call from Gmail or video chat. Um, but I haven't gotten that to work on the uh, Surface RT because I think it requires uh, a, a plugin to be installed, which can't be installed on the RT. But other than that, you know, I don't I don't use other features, so I'm not able to test that out. But other than that, I'd say that the Gmail website um, on the Surface RT is fully functional. You don't have to install any app; you can just use the Gmail website. And for the most part, it is actually very responsive and every almost everything works as you would expect it to. You can change settings on here, you can check notifications, you can compose emails, re respond to emails, uh, do your tasks, the calendars, contacts, all that stuff. Uh, everything actually works on here. So just a super quick video to show that in action. Uh, thanks for watching.